Hello and welcome to our video series on Smart FTP. Now in this video we're going to be showing you how to manage your files. Now remember as you're watching this video you can always use the pause and rewind buttons below the screen to watch and rewatch this video until you have this task mastered. So let's get right to it. Naturally the first thing we want to do is go ahead and open up our Smart FTP software. And now that we've got it open Let's go on up to our favorites and use our quick connect that we set up in our previous video on setting up your connection. There you go and now we just click on that and we're connected. Now first off we're going to create a new folder. So just anywhere in the remote browser window right click on your mouse and scroll on down to new and then folder and then just enter the name that you want for your new folder then you just click anywhere and that should accept the name yep that works Now let's try to rename one of the files. So let's select the file that we want to rename. And right click on that. And then select the rename link. And then type in the name that you want to rename it to. Then just click anywhere and that should accept the, the, the new name. Now to delete, it's fairly simple. Just select the file or the folder that you want to delete. And then press the delete key. Now we get a confirmation message. You know, for safety purposes. And then just click OK and it's gone. Now sometimes a file may require write permissions. By default a file may only have read only or execute permissions only. So to change that let's just right click on the file that you want to change and scroll on down until we get to properties and select that. Then over here if you want to make the script writable, then just check the appropriate checkboxes. And then click OK. It's that simple. And that's going to bring us to the end of this video on how to manage your files using Smart FTP.